I've been using the Ratio Generation 2 Smart Sprinkler Controller for the past few weeks and I am really impressed with it. The controller definitely lives up to the hype. It's the number one best selling automatic irrigation controller on Amazon for a reason. It's definitely the most polished, the most full featured controller on the market right now. It waters 16 zones, it connects via Wi-Fi. The setup is super simple with the smartphone app. It gives you tons of information, data, charts, and graphs. It even has an open API and it integrates with if this then that. It's EPA WaterSense certified, which means you can get a big rebate if you jump through the water company's hoops. And it's even made in Colorado. How cool is that? So the hardware on the Ratio is really nice. The outside cover is a little flimsy and kind of feels like some cheap plastic, but the, the controller itself is nice. When I mounted it up to the wall, it felt very sturdy, like it was not not going anywhere compared to a couple other sprinkler controllers I've used where they've kind of flopped around and, and didn't really sit tight to the wall as I would like. When the Ratio's on, it has this cool blue LED that's kind of always on, lighting up your garage, and it's kind of a cool little touch. Getting the Ratio wired up with the sprinkler wires was not that hard. Pretty much every sprinkler controller is super simple to get wired up. You unplug the old wires, you make sure you know which zones are which, and you plug in the new ones. The Ratio was a little hard to push in uh, compared to some other ones I've, I've set up but I'm not sure if that was just because I had these stickers on it that are identifying the zones or, or if it just was extra tough. I had to do it a couple times because I had accidentally routed the wires on the outside of the unit and then realized, oh, I did this wrong and had to redo it. And then once you get it all uh, wired up and plugged in and turned on, the, the setup is quite easy. You download the app to your smartphone, the Ratio requires you to use a smartphone. It senses it on the Wi-Fi network and it, it was pretty automatic. I didn't even have to put in my home Wi-Fi password to get it onto my home Wi-Fi. I guess it talks through your phone and gets that information. That was kind of a first for me. Then you input the serial number of the Ratio so then it can talk to the Ratio servers. You like set up your own little account, get all that rolling. It goes through pretty quickly, pretty smoothly. It's an easy onboarding experience. After that, it starts detecting your zones. So it does like, it tries to activate zone one and then you hear your sprinklers going and it's like, okay, zone one's running. Do you hear it? And you hit okay. And then you go through. And the really cool part about the Ratio setup is that it goes through this step-by-step -step process where it asks you the details of your zones. So the first thing it asks is what's growing in the zone. Then it asks what type of soil is in the zone. And then it asks how much uh, sun hits the zone. What type of sprinklers are you using on the zone? And what kind of slope is on the zone? So all these little details, all this little information kind of goes into the Ratio database and it helps the Ratio decide how much it's going to water that zone. And so far I've found this to be an awesome formula. It's, it seems like the Ratio algorithm is spot on because I use a plant link soil sensor in my yard in one of my zones and I've been keeping track of the plant link and how it's kind of saying how much water is in the zone versus the Ratio and its estimation of how much water is in the soil and they're pretty much spot on. So the plant link, which is a physical thing that's stuck in the ground, is saying, hey, you should water next Sunday. And then the Ratio's algorithm is basically saying the same thing that, hey, I'm gonna water next Sunday. So I feel like the Ratio algorithm is spot on and this is gonna be a great thing for my plants uh, coming in this coming summer. And it just means that I don't have to worry about this stuff anymore. This is why I got into smart sprinkler controllers. I don't wanna worry about it. I don't want it to be watering when it's raining out, but even more so, I want it to water when it needs it, not water when it doesn't. And to really get my grass growing good and really get my plants growing the best they ever have, instead of me trying to guess, okay, 15 minutes a day for each zone, I guess that's enough. Another cool feature in the Ratio is that you select your weather station. And the weather station that it had for me is actually decently far enough away that it's a kind of a different microclimate. It gets a lot colder at night. So I decided to use a different weather station that is basically on this other list called the personal weather station list. And I found one that's only a, like a mile away from my house. And I was able to check that weather station out and see that like it's recording precipitation data and that it probably will be a, a good fit for my, for my house. And I just thought that was so cool that there's random people out there that set up these weather stations, plug them into the internet and share this data for all of us to use. So once the ratio starts watering, 
it you can start looking at your data and all your usage stats and I love that. I love that it has all these charts and graphs and it's almost information overload, but I think if you're buying a smart sprinkler controller, you're already kind of a geek. So this is just right up your alley that it's gonna show, oh, you've used this many thousands of gallons of water and oh, it, it, it watered less this day because of this and that. And I, I just love it. I love all the details. I love the charts. I love it all. And even the soil moisture thing is not a secret. You can dig into each zone and look at the details and see each piece that it's using to calculate what the soil moisture is and even see a graph of the soil moisture in that zone. The app offers you everything you think you should have in an app, right? To be able to manually water zones, start stuff, stop stuff, change the schedule, anything you can think of you can do inside the app. So I touched on the EPA WaterSense certification thing a little bit, but I think I wanna harp on it a little bit more because in my county, I can get a 50% rebate if I jump through the water company's hoops. So they send someone out to your house and like survey and look at your, your setup. I have to have four zones. I have to have a thousand square feet of landscape. And I think I qualify for all that stuff, but you have to have them come out before you install it. So they look at your old sprinkler controller and then they look at your new one. And then you, of course, you have to fill out some forms and mail them in and I don't know, it, it's, it's a couple of hoops to jump through for, but for 125 bucks of free money for something that you're already gonna do, it might be worth it for you. The one place that really shines for me with the Ratio is the geekiness. The, it has the open API, it has all this data that you could take into your own apps or build your own things around or create your own dashboard with which I just think is awesome. I might not end up doing any of it, but just the ability that it's built in, that it's there for developers and anyone to take a hold of is awesome. And then if you're really not a programmer or developer type person, you can go into If This Then That and connect your Ratio, turn it on, connect it, and then you can start to connect it to other smart devices. So you can do something like, if the Ratio starts watering, log it to a spreadsheet or send me an email, or light up the light bulbs in my bedroom to turn purple. So there's almost these thousands of possibilities that you could do for when your ratio turns on, when your ratio turns off, when it skips a day, to like notify you or interact with the world some way. So in conclusion, the ratio is gonna save you money, it's gonna save you time, you're gonna, it's gonna save you peace of mind because you're not gonna be worrying about your sprinklers anymore. You set it and you forget it. How great is that? The data is completely transparent, it's accessible, you can dig in, you get these awesome dashboards and tells you all this information. You can customize every little bit of it. You know, my only real criticism of the Ratio, which isn't much, is that 16 zones is probably overkill for most people at this time. So they're probably gonna release the eight zone version that's gonna be a hundred bucks cheaper, but they're kind of waiting on that to you know, get the first flood of people that are into getting it now, and then who knows, maybe six months or so, they'll release an eight, eight zone version that's 100 bucks cheaper, and most normal people, that's probably more up their alley. But for us geeks that, are, that wanna get into it now, it, it's a great time, it's a great device. I can't recommend it highly enough. Thanks for watching, take it easy.